Hi, everybody. You're stuck with me again tonight. <laughs> uh, I want to come on, and so I came into Scrapbookers and Seasons of Creativity and YouTube. So I wanted to unbox our recent, uh, this is for February, and kind of give you, an, I, I got a couple of fun things to show you, though. We've got um, the Seasons of Creativity, which ships out in, well, it shipped out in February. And then I have, oh, I'm going to post you the link. We have two single February boxes that um, we have available. You can either sign up on the subscription, and then you'll get the June and the October and the following February. So the box ships every three months, every four months months every march april may every four months so you get everything at once and you get all the tutorials and let me have you hold and we um anyway I want to go live with it so that you guys can see what comes in your box for the four months. During that four months, after you get your tutorials, everything is in a group on Facebook and you'll get to access the videos and a newsletter every month with extra projects. Now, sometimes like this one, this is our second, our, hi Sherry, our designers, um, will do extra projects with what's left. So you get to use everything. You're going to use everything in your box. And in this one, I have to show you a brand new paper line that nobody else has gotten. You may have only seen it in your seasons box because it will be, um, I'm going to show you, it's going to come out on the 15th. And I will be showing you that paper tonight. Kind of got to change chairs. I'm sorry, this one's too low. And I have three chairs in my office. Isn't that crazy? Sometimes I have to switch them. As a crafter, you know, our butts get tired, right? <laughs> and then some of you, yeah, if your box hasn't arrived, it, it's they're in transit. We had some new subscription startup that got theirs. They are leaving in the morning. So don't worry though. You've got plenty of time. All the tutorials are in our seasons of creativity uh, group. And this is where we're going to start. Now this box after I show it is one that um, you can grab. So I want to be very careful with it so that because I'm going to, it's one that I'm using it to show. And then it definitely um, is for sale. So I'm going to open my box and then I'm move it to the side. So we have plenty of room. So when you get your box, they are heavy. They're heavy. And they also, this time, and we already had one Seasons of Creativity subscriber show her there was a special birthday. And she just won $25 gift certificate on her box. So we'll have different fun things in there throughout the year. There we go. So our first, let me go ahead and get this open. Thing that you're going to get is your little like embellishment pack. We have the double-sided tape that the designers will use. And your crafty foam cake, because lots of fun things in this collection to pop up. Oh, do you want this one, Teresa? It's yours. <laughs> it is yours. And then uh, you guys have got to see all the different things that uh, has been made. Tiffany used this on her, her project, and it's just gorgeous. So the designers, the whole thing with the Seasons of Creativity... We want to show you what you can do completely with all your paper. And we want you to use it, not have it laying around your craft room. We want you to make projects with a purpose. The whole idea is that you're going to make projects that 
are going to be great gifts or that you're actually going to use in different themes each time. And like I said, it comes out every four months and you've got a box full of tons of different items that you can just either grab and go to a crop with or definitely work with at home. This doily die. So, and it's also not just good for this kit. You're going to use this, trust me, on tons of items. Look how stinking cute. And I'll tell you, Echo Park, he was awesome. He had these made for us because they were stinking out of them. And it's like, I got to have these. <laughs> so they had them made for seasons. And then you've got a magnetic sheet with this one to hold your dice. So our seasons boxes will have different fun, crafty items like this that um, you'll be able to use and that we will be building on. And there goes the dogs because they know I go live. I'm trying to put it back correctly. Hi, Cheryl. Yes, if you did just order your box on Friday or this weekend, it does leave tomorrow. So I'm going to put everything back. And that, like I said, is just on the top of your fun box. Now, one thing that is super awesome about our Seasons of Creativity is your grab and go. And we started this last year. No, you, um, what happens is when you get your dies, you do take them apart. Now, let me tell you, they, you can leave them together. I believe they still work, but I use my wire cutters and I've got that little pair right here. Well, no, these are needle nose. Even these, I just kind of pull them apart, but you, most crafters, you should have these or go out to your husband or your brothers or your, whoever has tools and wire cutters. Um, I will, Teresa, absolutely, and wire cutters, and then you just cut those apart. Now, our grab-and-go this time, oh, Teresa, I may have to, I'll have to put a new sticker on here. I'm so sorry. Okay. Is the grab-and-go, the whole idea with our grab-and-go, grab-and-go, grab and go is if you're going to go crafting on the weekends, you want to go to a crop, you grab you grab this, you pop it in your, you pop it in there because you're always going to have, you're going to have a different one each time. You're going to have either some type of a, a neat thing to carry your stuff in. Okay. They're going to, and they're different every time. You're going to take this to your crop or your friend's house and the grab and go will have cardstock in it. This one has your, there is seam binding that matches then we have our 49 and market vintage artistry and you should see the project oh my goodness like i said oh we have a special group so i'll repackage this we have a seasons of creativity so some of you are watching in seasons of creativity some are watching on youtube now like i said there's only two boxes left well one is gone there's one box left and for those of you if you sign up now it's for the June box, but I'll tell you what, it guarantees your June box and it's already halfway planned. I mean, more than halfway. It's, it's just adorable. So our 49 and market, Debbie Alley created with this collection and the 49 and market is, it's definitely, it's a heavier cardstock and you, but you can use it for mixed media but she made a beautiful beautiful project with it and i'll just kind of go through so this look at this one this will be a beautiful project we've got uh planning of gardens coming up and you can use it for um you know i always take pictures of the beginning of our garden we have a huge one out back and it's a, just going to be a super nice place or a bridal shower because the Soft blues and greens, absolutely gorgeous. Oh, did you already start? Oh, see, some of you already started. Tian uh, has already started the grab and go today. 
Um, she had to stop fix dinner. And, you know, that is the thing. Our family needs to eat. You know, they ruin our crafting, right? <laughs> then we have the wishing bubbles that match the vintage artistry. Okay, that'll need a new package. Then for this one, you have your 100 pound eight and a half by 11 cardstock. So this one will have your cardstock. And she, this is the one Debbie used was the artisan linen eight and a half by 11, 100 pound. Okay. And then you've got the beautiful, beautiful green. This one's Spanish moss, and then you'll have a silver, silvery gray. And again, this is super fun to grab and go. So that way you can um, just pick it up. I need to repackage that one and head out and craft. So we'll set that aside. Then our second one, which also I need to explain our second one. Simple Stories has been so great. I'm just absolutely loving working with them on our on our pieces of creativity. Hi, Linda. But once in a while, they'll put something together and then we sell tons more. So I have to explain something to you. Um, it's not going to change really anything. Michelle Allen's project with this is adorable. You're going to die when you see it. And the only thing is our first um, bunch of, of Season of Creativities will have what looks exactly like this. Your, if you're buying it now or except for this one, or you, you purchase this weekend, you won't have the journal bits. You're going to have the frames. And I kind of will be showing you, so you can use the frames in different ways, like on the cover of the album. But you will have these, and you have, you have your decorative brads. You'll have your page pieces. The frames will just replace, frames replace the journal bits. And the papers will be just a hair different. So in this collection, we, we're using the wildflower because it just goes with the project that she's made. Absolutely gorgeous. But you're going to see that you may have two of this one. Simple Stories did run out of some of the papers, so we put two of these beautiful pieces in there and two of these so you still have the same count of papers and you'll have the and you still have the pink you just will have a little different on your single sheets well this one oh and you let's see you will have your sticker sheets well, this one has two pinks. Well, lucky you, Teresa. Cool. Um, this one has, and you will have your sticker sheet, okay? So they had those. The only thing that they did run out was the journal bits, so you will have frames. If you ordered later on and towards the end. We had so many of you that saw this, and you just like, I want it. But I'm like, okay, but we've got to make just some, some um adjustments and it still works and i will make a post and i will show that in our seasons of creativity group so that one is michelle allen's i'm showing one of them last because i have to show you that new collection then you're going to be working with the little things from g45 which is nicole uh, Nicole Lynn's project. Um, oh, Linda Hess. It, okay, good. Always need. Um, yes, we'll be showing. The, and Vanessa, I have one box left. It's yours if you want it. Yeah. Uh, so the boxes are gone. I have two left. One for Teresa Cooley. And Vanessa, you're the next one that asks, so it will be yours. You know, you can either go on and sign up for the subscription 
and you'll get the subscription. You'll pay now, and then your subscription will come out every four months at 149. And really, you don't want to miss the June box because we've already got everything here, and it's amazing. Okay, Vanessa, it is yours. And um, June's is already. I am so excited about June's. Anyway, back to this. So we've got the little seed envelopes that Nicole and her project. Wait till you see. It looks like a little garden. And then you open it and it's a folio. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. We've got that beautiful crocheted lace butterfly and the red ribbons. And of course, the um, this darling paper from Graphic 45, Little Things. And it's the perfect springtime paper. But you just wait. Not only are you getting these single sheets. Absolutely adorable. And the mushrooms. And the flowers. And the beautiful border strips to work with. But you're getting. Are you guys ready for this? You're getting a full pack of the solids. Patterns and solids. And I'll be. These, to me, were the best patterns and solids that they have done in a long time. Be and you're getting the whole pack. They now come, you're, they're not um, at the top. You get, look, you get three of the yellow, the little polka dot circles. You get two of the yellow little things with the words. So... Wait, you're going to have leftover, so we will. You will also get the newsletter with the extra projects to do. Then you get two of the green forget me nots, and then two of the others. Then you're going to get four of the reds. Yeah, you're getting sixteen sheets at, um, along with these. You get like twenty-four sheets of paper. And the blues. Okay. So. This one is, like I said, Nicole Lynn's project. Um, Tanya emails out once a month. Plus, in the Seasons of Creativity group, you will have access to all the tutorials planting off anything and everything you want and you can then also create all of these projects in any any of the um any collections that you want the tutorials will work with any paper lines which is so awesome um yes debbie what will happen what will happen if you paid um, paid it in full and got the discount back in October. That means you get October's box, February's, and then June's. And then as long as you don't go in and change it, because you can manage the subscription yourself. As long as you don't change anything, it will renew at the discount price. You'll still get the discount. So you will get that. It, But it will be automatic. Okay. Tiffany's project. <gasps> Are you just dying here with all you get? Okay. Are you guys kind of getting the feel now? We've got spring and we've got, we've got the beautiful, beautiful spring everywhere. We've got spring flowers. We've got butterflies and we've got such fun, fun projects. So with Tiffany, we have... We have little ladybugs, and you have three sheets of six by six chipboard. So that's what she's working with. You get the chipboard. Then you're going to have, I have to show you this embellishment pack. You're going to have the little ladybug buttons. I'm trying to be very careful. But I can rebag everything. There we go. 
Hi, Beth. I saw that everything went well today, and I'm so happy for you. But we have our little ladybug buttons that Tiffany's using. And then this fun, fun, fun lace. You have yellow and white. Now, you may have seen that Tiffany used a red and white. Because sometimes the designers will get their packs before all the supplies are here and they like to get started. But we have yellow. And then look at this. So can you imagine the little fuzzy umbrella and antennas and things with this? Yes. So we have all of those fun things that just go with our little ladybug collection. I know, aren't those buttons just adorable? So cute, so cute. Okay. Let's take a look at this adorable paper. course we have the ladybugs oh, okay tiffany did do one project in a black and white ribbon and one in yellow and i just thought these kind of parts were the cutest you make me smile such happy paper more ladybugs more plaid you can kind of see plaid is really coming out this year again. And I, for one, am extremely happy about that. And more polka dots. And Tiffany's projects are just adorable. And the thing is, amazes me, um, is that, look at the green, how these designers stretch everything. It just, I'm just, ah, I'm in amazement because... They have created not only a project, but second projects. Hi, Alice Doll. Yes, I hope you are feeling better. Black and white. So these papers will also work with other things. Yay. Well, I am so happy you're with us, um, Vanessa. We've got that beautiful yellow. Look at this. Okay. This I thought was the cutest. Look at on the daisies. Yeah, little ladybugs. I know, Debbie, the back sides, you you definitely could take this whole back side and create a project. They did a great job with this. Now see that doily, how it matches the doilies in your kit. Yeah, this one. Look how pretty you might have if I show you the backs, huh? Look how pretty. And let's take a look at our sticker sheet. Just everything about it is so adorable. Then you have a sheet of yellow and red. And then you have an eight and a half by 11 artisan green cardstock to go with this. Doesn't that just make you feel like spring? It does me. Such a happy, happy paper. And we are all about the seasons of creativity in creating happy, 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 happy. Let me tell you. So we're going to put this back in. Oh, and the chipboard. And then our cute little embellishment package. Now, even though we have, you have, they are yours now. Even though you have the, the grab-and-go kit, 
any one of these would work as a grab and go kit, basically. Um, you just wouldn't have your card stock, but you have so many fun projects just to grab and go or to work with at home. And I'm not done. And we've got this one. So I want to kind of keep these together because I also want to show you what is coming out. And you, if you have your Seasons of Creativity box, you are already seeing it. We have Homer's Diner. We have um, Sweet Southern Mess that has home Wilbur on it. Homer's Diner was named after Wilbur. I mean, after Homer. Now we have Charlotte's Friends. And I cannot wait to show you Charlotte's Friends. Diane Witch Paper. Uh, you will be able to buy them all. First of all, Charlotte's Friends. Kim did the project, and it is another to die for project. So you've got some twine. Now you could have a pink, a blue, or a green ribbon in here, a twine in here, and but you do have the four buttons. I'm just wait, I want to make sure I answer Diane's question. Yes, Diane, the ladybug paper is already in the store in my store. Okay, so this is going to go on the website Thursday, February 15th, and this is called Charlotte's Friends. It's the spring paper line. So you, if you have the Seasons of Creativity box, you got it first. I'll show this in just a moment, the 8 by 8 So we're going to start with the 12 by 12 Now, Charlotte has a lot of friends, and, and you know what? I have to tell you, this suits her personality well because she's totally different than Wilbur and Homer. She is so, so sweet. So sweet. Oh, I need to actually, I'm going to have to take this back out. She is um, just the sweetest little thing. I'm going to turn this over because I want to show you a couple of things. Let me move sticker sheets and let me grab these plaids. So we have green plaids in the ladybug. The black and red does not go. But I want to get I want to get the green here. And I want to get the yellow. Then we have a green stripe. And then we have a softer blue. And I want to show you guys. And there goes the dogs. How well these will all go together. Oh, I am very sorry. I may have to mute. So you've got some mixing and matching that we can do. And the back side. So you have two of the 12 by 12. And the reason for that is Kim uses these. You probably saw the sneak peeks of her project. And her pro her she made the picket fences with these. So you do need both of the backs of these that she uses in her project. And look, I'm telling you, Charlotte has, Charlotte has a very diverse uh, range of friends to her piggy, to her ducks. And we've got bunny. So this is gonna work for your Easter. This is going to work for your spring. Look. Super adorable. And like I said, this is one of the perks. If you got the Seasons of Creativity box, you got this first. And here we have the kitty. Because Charlotte, of course, she's never really met the kitty. But 
And then you've got the kind of toil on the back. I love her friends too, Roseanne. Aren't they adorable? Uh, baby album, yeah. Now, I know that maybe you guys don't all have the love for the Beagle. <laughs> but there's Charlotte, Wilbur, and yes, Homer's in pink because, you know, he is also, he's very, he does what Charlotte tells him to do. <laughs> but you can cut this away and then you've got a beautiful scenery for those of you who may not be uh, Beagle lovers. But there's baby Charlotte. And again, on the back, same scenery. We took the same scenery so that um, we just removed we moved Wilbur, Homer, and Charlotte from there. And that way, if you love the scenery, you can just flip it over. Oh, uh, yeah. I, you know, I love beagles. I love dogs. But beagles, yes, are my favorite. Then we have the piggy. This will make an absolutely adorable baby album, yes. And then we have the frog. And we have the green toil on the back. So you can really see how this will also go with the plaids from Ladybug and also from Graphic 45. And here we have her bunny friends. They're getting ready to come out and play. Mama's got to get them ready for the day. And again, we have the carrots on the back. Isn't that just adorable? Mrs. Mouse. And the pink toil. No, no opossum on this one, Carolyn. But we have the ducks. This would be just the most adorable layout. If you and actually, I have you know Charlotte when she was getting her first bath, or you could use a baby. Me, I'll use my beagle, and um, I really got to get my grandkids' pictures out from their first bath because that'd be cute too. But I will put Charlotte's in here, and that would be a really cute layout just for a frame or a book. Then we have the blue. And here we have Charlotte without her brothers and Mrs. Mouse, Miss Mouse and Mr. Mouse and the goose. So we have the bunny. We have quite a bit of her friends here. So there's just one sheet. Um, oh, and then we have the green flag. We really only just have, you know, the one sheet with all three of the beagles so that we you weren't overwhelmed with beagles <laughs> but it's so cute isn't that just adorable just adorable and so that is the and what's the boot oh i love the kitty that's the 12 by 12 you got and let's go through the 8 by 8 so and then you got the 8 by 8 pad of course, you got smaller little cut of parts. And again, on this, you've got the bunnies out gathering their food for the day. And the toil. I know, I can't stand it. This is so cute. And then your beautiful scenery. The nice thing is you're making an 8x8 album. You don't even have to cut this. Then you just put your flap or your cut apart and you have that beautiful, beautiful scene. Um, this does have companion papers, by the way, Tiffany. Um, they are printing and... But I had decided to go ahead and put this out. Your companion papers will be in the plaid colors. Oh, I'm making an album with this one. And I hope Tiffany is too. Then we have the pink and the plaid. And our frog and our toil. And 
again, this would be just a beautiful baby 8x8 album. And you don't even have to really cut the papers. And you don't really have to do anything but add your photos. Such Isn't it just awesome for spring? And it's different. Now, on the back, if you notice, you have the wolf. And she's, mama's got him by the ear. I forgot to show you guys that. He's in trouble. I'm sure he was chasing his little friends around. Okay, there's our duckies. And that is... This is going to be available for purchase on the 15th. Again, this is in your Seasons of Creativity box. Some of you are still waiting for it to be delivered. And the excitement, oh, it is in the excitement. Oh, my goodness. I don't know about you guys, but I've been so excited about this one. And, whoops. And if you want to get in, I know, I know, I know. I know it's a little in advance, but if you go on now and you buy the Seasons of Creativity, these are sold out, the February. So you don't, you guys don't wait. You need to get on there because I feel so bad when I have to tell you that they're sold out. Um, you're going to go jump on the website right now and order it. You will be charged, but that is for June. And that will guarantee your spot. You will get the June box. And you won't have to be saying, oh my gosh, did I miss out? Because once they're gone, they're gone. I'm telling you, they went fast. And if you're, you know, especially in June, you're getting ready probably to go camping. And you guys are, you're traveling. And, you know, I don't know about you, but I craft when I'm gone. Um, you want to grab this and take it with you so you can go and work on your projects. So make sure, make sure you don't miss out. I'm just going to set this back in. This one has been spoken for. Yeah, you don't want to miss June's box. And if you guys knew, okay, we just had our birthday bash. We are having birthday bash number two. And you do not want to miss birthday bash number two. Um. Everything's been purchased, bought. We are, Tiffany has already started um, on her project. It's amazing. All of our designers have. And so the birthday bash number two is April 13th. Make sure you don't miss out because that box will ship the end of March. Let's see, when you sign up, that, yes, it will, uh, no, well, you have a choice, Carolyn. You can choose to sign up and have, all three it's for three months i mean three boxes because it's every four months and you will get a discount if you signed up and paid it was 402 with the discount that's only 137 dollars for a box 137 plus the free tutorials plus the group that has the newsletter each month so that you know what to use your your scraps with and um you don't want to miss it it's such a good buy but yes, if you buy, if you sign up now, it'll take your payment out, but it's for June. And then, so you're kind of like four months. Yeah, but we are actually working on moving those dates so that they're more in line of, of when we ship. But you do pay for your box in advance. Oh, hugs. Hugs to you too, Beth. And just, you know, thinking about you that all is well. And you don't, uh, let's see. Yeah, and then you are guaranteed, though, that you won't miss out on this because you get a die with every single one of them. And then you get other fun crafting supplies. And that does include shipping. So, you know, that's a, that's a heck of a buy. Plus, you get, you get new things in there. It's so much fun. And I can't wait to show you our themed one that we're doing for June as we get a little bit closer. And then also, the nice thing is you can go into your account as long as you, well, you've got to make an account on the website at countrycraftcreations.com. 
go, uh, you can go on there and you can track, you can check your um, tracking number to watch your box when it's coming. And you can also um, manage your subscription right on the website. And then we're always here to help you too. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the Seasons of Creativity. I know many of you have now started working on your box. Oh, they ship the 10. So this box is shipped. They're now totally sold out. And they will ship again on June 10th. But the next four months, you're going to get a newsletter every month on the 10th. And you're going to get ideas to use your um, leftover papers. Now, I believe, I don't think, I think Debbie uses every single bit of it. You're not going to believe Tiffany actually made another little album to go with it out of hers. So you get two projects from that. Um, you're going to get ideas on, there might be cards. It's just going to be so different every month. But you're going to use every single thing in this box. Oh, you're welcome. Yes, and if you haven't received your box, I know they're all headed out for delivery. And I will get the other two uh, box fixed and sent out your way guys so thanks for watching and i hope you enjoyed seeing our seasons of creativity boxes for for february have a great night bye bye